Interoperable open architecture has many meanings for different people. This is the new way of doing business in the 21st century. We are embraced with commercial rapid functionality in mobile phones and we are trying to embrace that business model in a 30-year life cycle of weapon systems and that requires new thinking from all the stakeholders about how to best position ourselves and share the limited resources or dollars we are going to have. We started a couple years ago with folks that recognized the fact that we did need a, an open common architecture basically owned by the government that we could manage that had uh, well-defined interfaces that we could uh, enable competition and commonality. The importance of uh, having open architectures and being interoperable is that in the end it saves you a lot of money and we want other nations to know that we work on it. And that we want them to know how far we got. We also want them to know the problems that we couldn't solve. Already today I got some very uh, useful contacts from other fora and groups that work on similar problems. The caliber of people here, the diversity of people briefing is interesting. We have Europeans, Americans uh, talking about the same problems. Eventually our markets are going to blend and therefore uh, sooner or later we'll be sharing applications between the two continents. I think that I'm going to have a lot of homework because I get a lot of cards from people and there's going to be a lot of follow-up from this. Um, certainly people that want to know more from us and people that we would like to know more about what they're doing.